What's up, everybody? Tim Murphy with Drift Sessions. We're here at Clutch Kickers Round 3, and I got Ben Julian in the pits here. Ben, tell us a little bit about yourself and where you're from. Ben, I'm just a local shredder. I come from Lakanto, Florida, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> All right, so you're running this blue Miata. Tell us about your car, what year, and just what you got done to it. Okay, it's a 90 Miata. It's got a LS1 with a sloppy stage 3 cam in it, a CD009, like 350Z trans. Uh, CTSV diff from like a 07, 08 CTSV, and it's been a solid car. Really haven't had a whole lot of issues. Um, just rips. So Miata platform. I've seen Miatas 10, 15 years ago. They never really tend to to do that well. What have you done, or what secret have you found in a Miata to slay? Like you're, I mean, you're slaying people out there. Yeah, I feel like my biggest secret for the Miata is just seat time. Seat time over everything else. I've been driving one for like roughly eight to 10 years now. Only ever driven Miatas and I'm just super comfortable in the chassis. Um, also luckily within like the past couple years, we've had a few companies that have come out with parts that support drifting with Miatas. So now we have destroyer die drop knuckles and rear drop knuckles and front stuff, which has helped a lot as a chassis. Before that we had cut knuckles and that was pretty much it. So there's a lot of people out there, obviously, prior to this that were afraid to use it in Miata. Is there anything that you could tell those people out there, tips or anything you could provide if they're looking to go into a Miata? The biggest thing I would say is alignment is really crucial on them. You need to get a little bit of toe out in the front, a lot of toe in on the rear to kind of take the snap out of the car. It makes it a little slower on transitions and easier to drive. That's probably the biggest tip I could give for Miata specifically. Nice. All right, so you're obviously not new to drifting. You've been drifting for a little bit. Tell us a little bit about your experience. What got you into drifting? What chassis you started in? Just kind of tell us all about it. Okay. Pretty much started, uh, I want to say like 2012, I started drifting. Um, had a stock Miata back then that I used to just go to the local events. I was always a grassroots driver. I loved like OSW, DeSoto, travel around, try to drive every weekend if I could. Um, once Clunch Kickers popped up, I loved the idea of the series to let the small guys come out, compete with the big guys, have a chance to make money. And I was hooked and just wanted to get into that. Nice. All right. So you're definitely the man to beat out here today, right? That's why you, all eyes are on you, correct? We can keep up the momentum for sure. Yeah. Good deal. Good deal. So tell us about your sponsors. Uh, pretty much sponsored by myself. Ben's used Miata parts and uh, that's it. Well, so tell us about Ben Used Me Auto Parts. What can people find at Ben Used um, Performance Parts or Auto Parts? Yeah. Auto Parts? Yeah. So basically, we're a junkyard. Uh, we specialize in just Mazda Miatas, primarily 90 to 05 Miatas. Pretty much anything you need, uh, we've got it. Okay. And where can they find you? You got a website, uh, social media? Yeah, Ben's Used Me Auto Parts on Facebook, um, Instagram. I just use my personal one, which is bhooligan33, and then eBay. It's the main things. Well, we got Ben Julian here. He is amazing to watch, always exciting, always putting the big guys to the test. He's like the giant slayer. Well, Ben, thank you for your time, and we look forward to seeing you again.